so it will be something like this so you have the complete chip divided into two areas two sections you can say and this section has got one two three four five six seven eight clock endpoints and this one has got one two three four five six seven eight clock endpoints now you have this section and we have this section so each each section now the second step will be to divide each section in in such halves such that each such that the other subsections will be having again the same number of clock endpoints so something like this let's let's do that so you will have this section you will have this section you will have this one and you will have this one now each section has got four different clock endpoints if you see if you closely see the, well, let's say this section it has got one two three four and same for this one also so now the next job again remains to divide this these four sections into again some 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 more subsections such that each subsection will be again having equal number of clock end points so let's do that again yeah so now this section has got two clock end points this one has two clock end points this one has two this one has two and similarly for the other subsections